know, it's, it's, I think sometimes, uh, you know, it's a little hard uh, to, to, to have, you know, any kind of perspective now if you just lost. Uh, you know, it's, uh, but, you know, proud that we won two out of three. And, and really, you know, we played fairly well except for the first, you know, three three innings or so on the mound in this game where, you know, once again, we, we just kind of put ourselves behind the eight ball and just, uh, you know, you, you know, before you even wake up, uh, you know, you're down five nothing. But, you know, proud of the way we, we played overall for the weekend uh, against uh, a very, very good Florida team. You talk about wanting consistency coming into this weekend. Do you think on Friday in the first game of the day you guys kind of found that pitch well and gave some early run support and all that? So that one more time because oh, uh, for... he, he was mad because oh, you got two questions in a row. But go ahead. <laughs> no. Searching for consistency coming into the weekend. You pitched well, got some early run support for your guys. You think you're slowly starting to take steps to finding that consistency more regularly? Uh, you yeah. know, I think so. And you know, we uh, I think we're getting better. I think we've we've shown that uh, you know the last couple weeks. Uh, uh, but but you're right. It, it's about being consistent and being able to perform. And uh, you know, certainly the first two games we, we, we pitched well. We started to get some timely hits. You know, Friday night uh, we didn't get a ton, but but we we got two that counted, and uh, you know that's really what we've lacked. You know, uh, I know the, the batting average is not what we want, but we, we we tend to get runners on. You know, when you look at our our leadoff percentage and, and how we start innings, uh, that hasn't really been an issue. The issue's been you know you're scoring them, and, and then the other part of it is you know being consistent with field on the mound. And you know, I thought you know at least through the first couple of games we did that. Thank you. Brady stayed sharp, I guess, especially through the delays, too. He was able to kind of manage through all that third inning and, you know, take it forever. And it was, up. you know, we just said, you know, it was, uh, they made it tough on him. They're good. You know, it's a good offense. And, uh, and even though he was putting up some zeros and, uh, but, but his pitch count was running. He, he was working for him. And uh, I think he gave up a lead runner uh, the first four innings. And that, that's unusual for him. And uh, uh, so, and, you know, then not only is he pitching you know, 21 pitches an inning, the innings are forever. I mean, uh, and the weather's you know, raining like it is, and it's damp, and it's chilly. And uh, he, he, he really, at one point, I wasn't sure if he was going to get really past about 75 pitches or so. And he kind of found a set, another gear there and was able to give us a couple more innings. This coach just... Uh just tough, you know, and it, it just wasn't, you know, it's one of those games where it just wasn't his day, and um, uh, he's terrific, and, and and I think the world of him, but this was probably as far as stuff, and I'm not, not, you know, not looking, just evaluating the stuff and how he pitched, yeah, that, this was by far the worst day, when you talk about, you know, command, which normally he just fills it up, and, and uh, velocity, and breaking ball, and it's tough, you know, it just wasn't, you know, he just didn't have his best stuff today and you know for freshman your first SEC start and uh, you know your first start your college start really and uh, you, know, you, you face the number one team in the country that has just been kind of helped down for the last two games and you know I thought it was a you know kind of a, a tough chore for him so it wasn't a good combination not pitching well and, and, and facing a team that you know was was ready to swing today. What was the explanation on Sykes and his deal? Uh, um, you know, Sykes lost his composure. There was obviously some words said between Tate and, and their shortstop, and then uh, you know Sykes used some prof profanity, protecting his little little uh, little brother, and um, you know got ejected for that. What do you think of Waggis back? I thought Wags did, you know, did well. He did well. He, you know, he came out, got out of that jam, and uh, I thought all the, you know, in the first two games, I thought we've really pitched well. We're talking about Friday night, I thought, you know, those guys continue. Trent, Bramlin, you know, Weathersby, you know, Wags, you know, Wyatt, um, you know, those five guys have been really uh, consistent for us and, and, and uh, you know, really, you know, held it together for us. Goals have been so that really well.